question number 12. Uh, figure 7 shows UV light passing through an, uh, an aperture and incident on the cathode of a photocell. So here we have the source of light, uh, the UV light, uh, the sun. We have aperture, this is the opening that is allowing the light to get onto the cathode of the photocell. This is the cathode here. Uh, so we have uh, a circuit here. Here is a millimeter. Uh, so that is the diagram that you have. So this is the UV light getting into or uh, uh, eliminated on the cathode of the photocell. Part A. State what is observed uh, on the millimeter when the size of the aperture is increased. So this this aperture is increased. It means more light, more UV light will be able to penetrate or to be eliminated uh, on the cathode. And therefore, it means that the cathode will emit more electrons, uh, which will be uh, received by the anode. And uh, as a result of increase in uh, increase in electrons, flow of electrons, it means there is more current, and therefore the 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 millimeter uh, hand will deflect. Uh, so the millimeter uh, let's correct that millimeter hand will deflect more or you can say um, uh, uh, higher or something like that but that's correct you, you get one mark. Part B, state the reason for the answer. Like I have said, a cathode emit uh, electrons. So as a result of increase of uh, uh, the aperture, so we can say uh, increase of aperture uh, increases the intensity uh, that is increases the uh, intensity of UV uh, on the cathode and like I've said more photoelectrons as a result Uh, more photoelectrons more photoelectrons are emitted at the cathode cathode so when more uh, photoelectrons are uh, produced, it means that uh, there will be more, the, it, it, there will be increase in the flow of charge as a result, increase in current, and therefore that's why we have said that the millimeter hand will deflect more. So by doing, answering that, you get two marks.